Hello everyone, here's another video brought to you by Mythics.com. Um, today we're going to be looking at the Mythics build. And if you haven't already have the build, you can go to Mythics.com, um, go to Getting Started with Fire Stick, and we have a zip file here with my build. As long as a complete guide, instructions how to install Kodi on your Fire Stick, as well as installing the build rather quickly. Alright, I, I just installed the build on my computer, so it may run a little bit faster than on a Fire Stick, obviously. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and open up that now. Alright, so here's the Mythics build. Uh, this is my first build, uh, so there's obviously going to be a lot more updates and more features coming to it. Um, but I wanted to make this as simple as possible for everyone to navigate around and really get the most of it without being so slow with tons and tons of add-ons that you don't ever use that we tend to find on other builds out there. Um, so right here, I'll, I'll just go through um, movies, um, featured in theaters, latest search. Um, again, I just want to make it as easy as possible. Um, so if we click search, we really can just search for a movie. So I'll just go ahead and search for home. And the video I don't use is going through Genesis. Genesis has been a really um, popular one and it's still going strong. Um, so that's the one I've been using. So here's all the ones for home. Uh, and then obviously we go back just to the normal um, Genesis add on itself, which I'm sure a lot of you guys are really familiar with. And so, yeah, there's uh, Genesis, the movies. I'll go ahead and go back. And then for TV shows, I, we also have it going through Genesis because it's still a really good rate one for that. Um, so you can search right here in the toolbar, uh, most popular and so forth. Uh, TV guide. All right, this is a big thing that you don't really see a lot of builds that work out nicely. Um, but I actually have a working TV guide as well as a little shortcut to most viewed or I guess popular channels out there. Um, Let's just jump around the TV guide. I'm sure a lot of people are interested to see how that works. <clears throat> Alright, so mine loaded up really quickly just because I, within five minutes, I installed it and I loaded up the guide already. Um, when you first do it, it's going to take maybe like two or three minutes to actually load up the guide completely. Um, so here's the TV guide. You can control with your mouse and on, obviously, with the remote and the fire stick. For me, I'm just going to click down here. So here we go. Um, yeah, Fox. There's tons of channels on here. Um, I mean, a lot of channels. Uh, you should be able to right click and then favorite them. It's, that would make it a little easier. And also in other videos, I'll give you guys a little tour of how to make those little hot bars I did myself um, for you to add channels and so forth. Um, Sky, all kinds of stuff on here. A good one that I really know. Let's see here. Discovery history. Okay, let's try that one. I simply just click on it, and it should load up our channel. Again, mine's mine's working really quick just because I'm on a my lap my laptop. But yours will yours will pretty good. And also keep in mind mine is streaming from T-Mobile's internet right now. Um, so yours may be you may stream a little bit better, um, not top. buffer, you can't and uh, video quality might look a little better a as well. So. So there's some live TV. Um, load back up. Let's see what else we have here. <coughs> Tons of channels. Um, there might be ones and twosies that might not work um, here and there, but for the most part, all the channels that I seem to watch work pretty good. So let's go Food Network. Viking River Cruises. Exploring oh, the world food network in east. Which another thing, um, you might be like, oh, how come I can't see the channels here on the west coast, or how come it doesn't line up with the east coast? Some of these live channel streams are coming from, are being hosted from either the east coast or the west coast. So you might not be able to watch exactly what's playing here, um, in your current time zone, from what's on the live TV end. Keeping it with Kardashians, that's actually one of my hot bar ones as well. A and E East. They always have a ton of channels on here. Um, Supernatural, we'll do, we'll do uh, one more here just to make sure. I'll show you guys. <coughs> and 
supernatural on TNT. Not a good fit, eh? There he goes. No the vampire. That one seems to go a little slow. Um, maybe my internet, like I said. But for the most part, everything loads really quickly. So, yep, there's the TV get for everyone. And then here's the little hot bar items I was talking about. I guess little shortcuts. Um, ABC Family put on there because obviously there's like going to be Christmas times around the corner. There's going to be a lot of good Christmas shows on there. Uh, and these should work really just the same as TV Guide. So we'll just uh, click on it here. Whoop. ABC Family. Couple of laymen tried this to one looks really good. themselves into the priesthood, and God killed them. Said that that cool. was a no-no. So there's I, I ABC that, Family. Um, I think oh, I guess I did not. I was gonna add a little news tab and put all the news channels on there, but I'll do that in a later build. Um, cool. Sports. There's little shortcuts here. I'm now playing. Let's see what, what sports going on. Uh, if there's sports, we just go through Sports Devil. That's the add-on that it uses. Um, I don't know if there's any sports because it's 740 in the morning right now. Um, so once you click on Sports Devil, here's all these little um, different hosts on here pretty much. Um, lately I've been using the LS Hunter and Vitbox. They seem to work out pretty well. Um, some of the little shortcuts are actually, I think they open straight from LS Hunter. And then once those are up, you'd be able to click on uh, a sport that's going on. So again, these are just little shortcuts. Baseball. The dates. And uh, click on now playing. Big sports fan, just want to put something on. And then here's the little time zone. So what time it would be going. There's the sports going on. And then we also have a kid zone. So for the kid zone, um, these channels down here, they are all the live stream channels. So if you want to put on Disney Junior, Nick Junior, Nickelodeon Needs, Cartoon Network, Team Nick, you can simply just click on it and it'll actually bring up the live stream. Um, or we can search, which when we click the search, it actually loads up through uh, Cartoons 8, I believe. So let's see, search cartoons. Um, let's just do Pokemon. I know Pokemon is one that a lot of people had trouble watching on the previous add-ons. So yes, Cartoon 8 here. So, there's all Pokemon. Pokemon the movie. Alright, so here, let's just click on one of these, make sure it works on here. Um, so everything in my build, I pretty much tested out myself just to make sure, then find the ones that are the most uh, reliable. Because I'm t I got tired of getting builds um, that I'd search for something and I'd be like, oh cool, it's there, and I click on it and none of the links work. So everything on my build um, and the, all the add-ons that I put on there are actually ones that are really reliable, especially Cartoons 8. Um, there's lots of Cartoon World um, cartoons, a lot of add-ons out there for cartoons that it would show up and I'd click on it and none of the links would work. So Cartoon 8 it definitely seemed to be one of the ones that worked out um, for at least 90% of the time. Same with that with other add-ons on here. Um, so there's just a quick rundown of the Mythics build. Um, power system, maintenance. Uh, I kept maintenance pretty easy. Here's a quick way to clear cache. Um, easy advanced settings. Um, on all your fire sticks, it's already set up for that. Um, so you don't really need to mess with that. That just basically made the buffer times load a lot quicker, um, depending on how much RAM each device had. And clear cache, quick and easy. Um, a little more in depth if you needed to. There's just a quick maintenance tool. Again, um, it might not be a maintenance tool that you've seen before, but uh, it's a reliable one. And we just make, we want to make this as uh, compact a build as possible with all the great features that we wanted inside of it. So there is a quick rundown on uh, the Mythics build. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. Please leave me any comments um, either on YouTube or uh, straight up on my build uh, build page, mythics.com. And alright, I hope you guys enjoyed the build.